On 28 August, as Boris Johnson sought to suspend Parliament, Donald Trump decided to go after Jeremy Corbyn, tweeting, would be very hard for Jeremy Corbyn, the leader of Britain's Labour Party, to seek a no-confidence vote against new Prime Minister Boris Johnson, especially in light of the fact that Boris is exactly what the UK has been looking for. Trump, at real Donald Trump, August 28, 2019 related articles but it didn't go very well for the US president. Because Corbyn responded with a superb takedown. What Trump meant to say. Corbyn corrected Trump's tweet, stating what he thought the president really meant. I think what the US president is saying, is that Boris Johnson is exactly what he has been looking for, a compliant prime minister who will hand Britain's public services and protections over to US corporations in a free trade deal. HTTPS colon slash slash t.co slash kcg to jko Jeremy Corbyn at Jeremy Corbyn August 28, 2019 One of the reasons Corbyn is critical of a no-deal Brexit is because, as he has previously stated, a no-deal Brexit is really a Trump deal Brexit. It's vital that politicians like Corbyn stand up to both Johnson and Trump. Because the bottom line is that Trump is a business person. He cares about making good deals, for him and his mates. He doesn't care about the UK and the prosperity of the country, he cares about what he can get out of it. So obviously Trump is happy with Johnson's compliance. It means he'll be free to raid our public services in a bargain basement Brexit deal. And this is something we need to avoid at any cost. Featured image via Wikimedia, R. Wendland and Wikimedia, president.gov.ua Let's block ads. Why?